morning. It's Saturday. You join me by my shoes and vinyl and DVD collection. You might be thinking, Jarf, what are you doing at 8.36am on a Saturday morning? Well, I'm not going to work. I've not got a gig. I am, in fact, going into the studio with the River Dogs. We've got some new recordings to do for more promo stuff for next year. So that's where we're going to be. But first, we need coffee. Done. Now, everything's been on charge. Switch, gimbal, power bank, got my cymbals, my kick pedal, two spl stands for splashes, snare drum, in-ears. That's everything that I need. So now, it's supply run time. But before that, this needs to be filled with this, and this, and this. And this, and this, and this. There we go, we're in. So we reach into the car with the gaff tape and we get our bag for life. We get a basket. We get some water and we find ourselves some snacks. 14 pound later, that's it. Two trips to the car down, but this is the control room. Big ass desk. Aircon. Flamingo. Fair enough. One more trip to the car. Set up. Start playing. And here we are, set up. This is nearly the final look. Need to change some of that around. But it's looking pretty bang on tidy. Not bad for half ten on a Saturday morning. So this is me. Got my Vic first sticks. Send me some free sticks. But all Zildjian, everything, yoink, apart from one splash, you know how to talk about that. Boom. If you think recording in the studio is glamorous, it's just a lot of hitting stuff while we get settings. But it'll be worth it when everything's done. And it sounds mega. Never let it be said that Jarv doesn't provide good cookies, party rings, loads of crisps, sweets, nuts. And for me, in here, is a switch when I need it. Oh, and hydration. Because some of them just drink water. I'll be having coffee and Monster. And some period of time later, we're actually going to start playing. So I'm going to mount this on this, and you'll see me hitting things. And fancy this as well. The light comes on. Apple Watch, beautiful thing. Of course, road juice, gig juice, shoot juice. 
Studio Juice. Thank you, Monster Energy. I have length, so I can move. But just waiting for Matt to find the words so he can give me a guy vocal. Because Matt doesn't know the words, but they're in there. Matt will know the words one day, I'm sure. Today is not that day. I'm not saying I'm excellent, but that was one take. There you go. Let's see if the rest can be. Snare by far. I didn't hit it. So welcome to the vlog, my own personal cameraman, Matt here. There he is. So getting all the footage. Okay, I'm there. Uh, I'm done. Full start. Is that me? Personal cameraman. So how's your day going, Matt? Uh, it's barely started to be honest. Actually, no, that's not true. I've had a good run. Back to the killers. Film section. Uh, Granted, his is bigger than mine. It but, is uh, a lot bigger. But I suppose it is how you use it. That's very true. You just gotta have the skill. Yeah. yeah, this is also another part of recording, waiting while you just uh, listen back to make sure everything was bang on. Now, this one is going to be a two take job, but the snare drum mic fell off. So that's not my fault. I didn't hit it. It fell off and I can't be blamed for that one. Does it feel good? It feels very shiny. 
Mm -hmm. It feels shiny. Yeah, we can see it shiny. Look at that glittering. It's like starlight. I'll take it back, that does feel shiny. Two for two. Setting up for track three, Sun Fleetwood Mac. Let's see if we can do this one in one take. Yeah, it's open. Update. That was my fault, but I've got it. drumming. He thinks I'm the best. I'll get some good bits in this.
behind the scenes of the behind the scenes behind the scenes. What we're doing at the minute, Matt is filming me playing not to track so we can potentially put our own shit on it because Matt is an expert cameraman. He's even got the headphones. That aren't plugged in. They're just to stop the old sound going in my ears. The man works for the aesthetic, which is how you know he's a great cameraman. So if you need anything filming, he's got very reasonable rates and he'll bring me along as well for also very reasonable rates. <laughs> You might be asking, Charles, why are you sat on the floor of the live room? Well, dear viewer, that's because we've just had an email from the agency asking us to record a song that we don't actually have in our set. So now I'm sat, I'm about to do a lead sheet for said song so I know what I'm doing. <sighs> Musician life. So it's not the entire song, but it's there. You can see Matt having a practice. He sounds lovely. The girls need some editing of what we've already done. And Dan's having a practice too. How's it going, Dan? Yeah, pretty straightforward. Easy yeah. job. Yeah. I could be playing the Switch right now. But no, we're actually learning tunes. That's what we do. But at least snacks. Are coming in very handy. Well done, me. <laughs> and that is me done for this recording. So it's time to pack all this down, dance into some guitars, and the back here tomorrow doing some uh, vocals, bass, whatever else. But pretty successful, including the last minute edition of a song I'd never heard before. Which again, one take. So, cheers. This was fun.